Good morning, happy Monday, and welcome to another week in my life. My name is Lauren, if you're new here, and I am a first year medical student. And if you're not new here, welcome back. So let me just address that there's holes in my shirt because this shirt is distressed, not because there's an actual hole in my shirt. Okay, anyways, because I was looking at that and it was bothering me. So today um, starts exam week, guys. It's back, it's happening. I have my first and last biochemistry exam one week from today on Monday. The way my current block is set up is the first half is biochem and then the second half is genetics. So my biochem exam is in a week. This week is gonna be a struggle, so that is great. Uh, yeah, I did not vlog last week because backlogging videos, again, somehow this keeps happening. Last time you saw me, I think I was coming from that all white brunch, which was really fun. So yeah, I also don't know if I spoke about this in my last video because it happened like when I wasn't vlogging in the moment, but I was vlogging last weekend, but we hit 1000 subscribers, woo! I could not be more excited, more happy. Oh my God, if you would have told me I was gonna hit 1000, like, I don't know, a few months ago, I just would have been like, no, there's no way, like it's not gonna happen anytime soon, blah, blah, blah. So I'm so happy. Thank you to everyone who's watching and subscribing. It really it just, like, it just makes me smile like this, like I am right now. So yeah, thank you. I have unlocked community posts. You unlock that when you hit a thousand. So I haven't done one yet, but I, I think I'm gonna do one when I release the video this week and just like, you know, really like say hi to the subscribers. So right now I am going to start lectures, so fun. I'm not gonna go to the medical school today. Yeah, I'm just not feeling it. I have been doing more studying at home. It has been going better than it was uh, maybe two videos ago <laughs> when Biochem first started. So I'm gonna try to do two lectures really quickly and then at one o'clock, I have something called doctoring and it's just gonna be on Zoom. And then after that, I am probably gonna take a break and eat something and then get back into lectures. I have something called a small group discussion tomorrow, which is when we all prepare cases in advance and then you're in a group. And then when you get there, a group will randomly be called off to present a certain case. So you have to be ready to present. So I have to prepare for that. I have two of those tomorrow. And then I have to type up a patient history from a doctoring session from last week. So I have a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot to do today. And guys, today is October. Eighteenth, I think. Halloween is like, it's like less than two weeks away. I'm stressed. I know what I'm gonna be. I don't have my outfit. So another, so non-academic goals for the day are order my Halloween outfit. Like it's getting ridiculous. I need to order it. I have to order it in two separate purchases because one piece that I need doesn't come with the other pieces. And then I really wanna tell you, but I just, I can't tell you yet. And then the day before I'm going out for Halloween, there is a formal like kind of dance situation at my school it's kind of like temple med or it's not even temple med it's like all the temple schools that are like professional schools and graduate schools so it's like prom kind of and i'm going so i need to get a dress for that as well there's so much to do so much to do and we're gonna just have to get it all done today because there's no time to do it any other day so yeah this week's gonna be very 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 busy we're gonna get back on the coffee this week it's gonna be Long mornings, long afternoons, long nights. It's gonna be a lot, but we've done it before and we're gonna do it again, so it's great. <laughs> no fear. <laughs> Lunchtime, woo! So I'm 
in doctoring right now. Let me flip the camera really quick so you can see. This session is on telemedicine. So it's just like a Zoom session for the first hour telemedicine, then the second hour it's a different topic. So while doctoring is going, I am just going to make some lunch really quickly. And my mom and I hit the jackpot and we found like, I don't know if you remember a few vlogs ago during one of my grocery hauls, I was like, yeah, we haven't been able to find any Jasmine Uncle Ben's. <laughs> so I found a bunch in the store and I bought nine. And then my mom found a bunch as well and bought, I don't know how many she bought, I haven't counted hers, but I have about 30 of these right now. So I'm like Uncle Ben's wealthy at this point. It's great. So I'm gonna pop one of these in the microwave and eat some chicken that my parents dropped off. Well, it is a smooth 7.30, just finished lectures. Go me, I'm still caught up. This is day two of me being caught up. I'm very proud of myself. And I really don't have any food, shocker. And I'm craving nachos and I'm craving Keeblers. And I think I'm gonna just go to the store. Now it's nighttime. It's not the best idea, I will admit. But sometimes the cravings just take over, you know? Sometimes, sometimes you just have to like let the id, you know, Freudian, psych, whatever. I don't know why psych is big with me today. Um, you just have to let it win. So I'm gonna go. I tried to call my mom so I could be on the phone with her while I was, you know, running around in the nighttime and she didn't answer. So I sent her that little unacceptable, like Adventure Time meme, I'll put it here because it's unacceptable. Next time you see me, I'll probably be back here smiling with nachos and Keeblers in front of me. I haven't eaten these in a week, but I can finally say all is right in the world. And of course, show of the week is blood and water. I'm watching season two. Good morning, happy Tuesday. I am on my way to school. I actually have to be in school from eight to 12 today and then again from one to three, so I plan on being there all day. Hopefully not all night, but probably all night. I probably won't leave until like maybe 8.30 at the earliest. So hopefully it'll be, not hopefully, it will be a good day today. Yay, gifts. Yay, Yay coffee. The juice of survival in med school. Hey. <laughs> We have a nice variety here. What do we have? We have a cold brew with caramel and a shot of espresso. Amazing. Yes. Hello, Tia. We have a iced mocha latte, no whip. Thank you. We have an iced mocha latte with whip, and we have an iced <laughs> mocha latte. I'll drink both. Very nice. Um. So here, still studying. We were talking about how when you get iced coffee and you hear this, it's the best sound ever. If you agree, comment down below. <laughs> <laughs> Just wanted to check in with you guys. It's 8.37, I'm still in the medical building. I'm gonna make a Quizlet for basically all the things we have to know. I'm choosing Quizlet over Anki just because the exam's in a week less than a week now. And it's kind of late to start Anki. And I just want something simple and Quizlet to me is very user friendly versus Anki is not as user friendly. So I'm just gonna get into that. And yeah, I don't know when I'm gonna go home. I'm like pretty hungry, but the vending machine is always, you know, my friend. So I'll probably go try to buy something from the vending machine. I'm there every single day. 1 a.m. Happy Wednesday, haven't vlogged today, but right now Kennedy and I are on our way to Starbucks, get some coffee. Good morning, happy Thursday, last night. Oh my God, I think the last thing you saw was me holding a bag of Wingstop, 
with the TV on. I was about to sit down, eat, have a good time, then get back to studying. I took a bite into the wing stop and I'm gonna, first bite, I'm gonna insert the picture of what, like I couldn't bite into it for some reason, the chicken, and then I like pulled out of my mouth and looked. <laughs> It's just so funny at this point because I feel like every time I, not every time, but like half the time I show you food before I eat it and I'm so excited and I'm like, wing stop, woo, yeah. And then like 10 minutes later after the camera's off and I'm eating the food, something bad happens. So like I know I, at this point I've talked about the food poisoning in literally every single vlog and it's been like six weeks. It kills me to this day that I had a whole cooking montage when I made that food and then just to get very sick the next day after eating it. Like that is that is just so ironic. So should I stop showing what food I'm gonna eat because then maybe I'll stop getting bad food? I don't know. Needless to say, Wingstop will be receiving an email from me this morning. It is Thursday. I have no solid obligations today for school. I don't have to be there at a certain time. So I'm going to head out now. I just took a shower, took my time getting ready. Don't know why. And now, yeah, I'm going to go. I think there's already quite a few people there studying. So probably join somebody and get going. I'm going to be studying all day. I'm currently making a Quizlet still for biochem. Yeah, I'm making a few Quizlets. And then hopefully I can finish all the Quizlets at a decent time today. Um, and then start going over some cases that I need to know for the exam. So yeah, that's the situation. I'm gonna head out now. Last night I got this crazy leg cramp. It's happened to me a few times before, like when I was waking up, not even last night this morning, to the point where I'm like writhing in pain and my leg still hurts, my calf specifically. So am I limping a little bit? Yes. Just wanted to say song of the week is Hello Baby by Young Ma or Young M.A. depending on you know how you say it. The lyrics in the song, incredible, absolutely incredible. She's such a lyricist. Just wanted to say that. I'm on my way to the caves of the Nanapa building now. Good morning, happy Friday. Last night I got home from the library like 12.30, 12.45. I walked in to my apartment, got on my bed and actually collapsed. I didn't eat, I didn't even change right away. I just collapsed, woke up a few hours later, changed my pajamas and then like re-collapsed. It was crazy, um, I was so tired. So, it's currently 12 p.m., so I guess happy afternoon instead of good morning. Um, I have nachos in the oven. You know what I decided, guys? Let me just apologize. You know what, let me sit down. When I edit my videos, the amount of times nachos appear in my videos, like, I'm sorry. It's, it's actually ridiculous. It annoys me at this point. I'm like, so I'm not gonna be showing you nachos for a long time, but know that I'm still eating them very, very often. I'm making like the biggest plate of nachos that I've ever made today because one, I haven't eaten in some time. And two, this sounds like really sad, but I want to kind of like eat as much as I can now because I don't know when I'm going to eat again. <laughs> oh my God, this sounds so annoying. I feel like, not that I'm some model student or anything, but I feel like usually I demonstrate like pretty good behavior, but don't be like me when it comes to eating. I'm not the only student who's like this, who like skips meals and everything. It's just not good. But my fridge is just completely empty. I cleaned it out yesterday, but I want to order food tonight to the library for dinner. Cause I usually don't eat like more than one to two meals a day normally anyway. 
But um, yeah, I'm really gonna try to do better with eating. It's just not fair to my body. So, but that is something like being honest that I'm like struggling with eating meals daily. It's kind of difficult. Anyways, today, like every other day, we will be in the library all day. I'm going a little later today just because I wanted to eat before I went. Cause if I don't eat before I go, then, you know, might not. So I wanted to eat before I went. So that's what I'm gonna do. Eat, just like relax, give myself a second. I'll probably watch a show or like a, a movie, not a whole movie, but just like part of a movie. Cause I just, I'm kind of in between shows right now. And then I'm gonna be at the library probably until I can stand it. I wouldn't say any earlier than 12. So we'll see. Yeah, yesterday I was like, of course we're learning biochem right now. And yesterday I was going through my notes, relearning everything, doing what's called a second pass of the material. And um, like one of the things I was going over, it'll look out, that's my smiling. One of the things that I was going over was um, the pathways for something called a statin, which is a medication that is prescribed often for people who have high cholesterol. And I was just like going over the pathway and just seeing like, just understanding how medications really work on such a like small molecular level is incredible. Just like the thought of like someone learning that much about the body, like from the very beginning, and then someone figuring out how to like adjust like different levels in the body and like creating medication that can do that. Like I just think it's so incredible. So I definitely am getting a new appreciation for biochemistry because I didn't really appreciate it as much before, I'll be honest. It's really cool to know how medications work, how diseases work, what would happen if you had a deficiency in a certain thing in your body. It is really cool. I'm just like thinking in the future when I'm a physician and I'm prescribing a patient a medication, like not only knowing, I know a statin will lower cholesterol, but like being able to really understand the pathway of why and how it would lower cholesterol, it just makes you an even better doctor. So yeah, I thought that was a cool little moment that I had yesterday, probably one of my favorite moments of the evening. And now I think my notches are ready because I can smell them. I don't know what time it is. It's probably been in there for a bit. So I'm gonna take them out of the oven, eat, run to the library, probably get coffee at some point today and study. Energy's up. I'm in a pretty good mood. So grateful to be in medical school. Wanna reiterate that point. I know like you see a lot of the struggles, but I am so happy to be here. And we're gonna just get it going. Somehow my AirPods are completely dead. Not off to a good start, but I have arrived. I have arrived. Finally heading home, woo! Good morning. City sounds. Good morning, happy Saturday. I didn't get a lot of footage from yesterday, but it was just a day of studying and then in between studying and getting distracted and talking to friends. And the day will be the same, hopefully less distractions. I'm gonna isolate myself today in the beginning of the day to really focus because the exam is two days away and a lot needs to get done between now and when I sit for the test. It is 10.54, I am going to head to school, but first I'm gonna stop at Starbucks because I wanna get a breakfast sandwich. Hopefully they have some. I've never been to the one that I'm gonna head to. I think today will be the last day of this vlog. I think I'm not gonna film tomorrow. It should be just like a repeat of whatever happens today. Hi David, thank you for choosing Starbucks. My name is Roman, what can I get for you? Hi, can I please have a tall iced mocha latte with an extra shot of espresso, espresso and an impossible breakfast sandwich. Okay, great, thank you so much. Thank you. That's embarrassing, I said espresso, it's very embarrassing. I've been in the Starbucks line for like 25 minutes. I'm like, that's, I would not come back to this one just because clearly it's just a little, little too busy. Oh God. I'm about to start studying, but I just wanted to say one, <laughs> I just watched this nine minute YouTube video while I was eating and I inhaled my food and my coffee. Like it was gone in like seven and a half minutes. 
And now I'm wondering like, am I okay? Because I've never, I've never eaten anything that fast. I've never drank my coffee that fast. I had an extra shot of espresso in there. Like that was insane. And two, when I ordered my coffee, so I always get a mocha latte, depending on the weather, I'll get hot or iced. For my ice, I don't like whipped cream in it because one, I don't know, I just don't really think the whipped cream is necessary in an iced latte. And then two, I don't like that it comes in a domed lid. And then you have to have a straw because I prefer a strawless lid because you know, the ocean and we're saving the turtles out here. Sometimes if you don't say no whipped cream, then they won't give it to you, but sometimes they will give it to you. I don't know what the actual true default is. I was given whipped cream and a whipped cream iced latte today. Um, but obviously I was in the Starbucks line for like, it ended up being like, I don't know, 40 minutes. I was in that drive through line. So I wasn't gonna say anything, like it's fine, I'll survive. I like whipped cream, I just don't need it in a nice drink. Anyways, I'm going somewhere with this, I promise. So <laughs> I was driving here and I'm like, what am I gonna do about this whipped cream? So I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna mix it into the drink. So I'm like mixing it really fast, like the, all the whipped cream like dissolves into the drink or whatever. And like I said, I had that extra shot of espresso and usually if I have an extra shot, I can really taste the espresso. But mixing the whipped cream in, it made the drink so much better. I don't know, like, it was so good. I think that's why I drank it so fast, because it was just so good. I didn't taste the espresso at all. It was, like, delicious, honestly. So, mm, it was good. I'm not going to get that every time, because, again, I don't want to get straws every time. I definitely will get whipped cream if I get an extra shot of espresso, because that was actually delicious. Like, delicious. Anyways, it's time to study. This is fun. I'm in this huge classroom and this classroom has carpet, which I love. So hopefully I can stay isolated. I don't know. I feel like someone's gonna find me at some point. <laughs> but I just need to focus. I need to, I need to get a lot done today. I'm not where I wanna be studying wise. So yeah, we have to pull off some miracles today, but we're gonna do it because we don't have the option not to. It is 5.51, I'm still studying. Of course, what else should I be doing? Um, yeah, I have a few more lectures that I wanna go through and make note cards from. And then after that, I'm gonna go through some case studies that we did um, with my friend, Kennedy, who you've seen several times now. And yeah, we're gonna be here all night. But no, my head is actually physically hurting from the amount of things that I've been like, shoving into my brain and learning. I feel like in anatomy, my head was never hurting like this just from studying, but I don't have the option to stop. So just like anatomy never stopped, biochem doesn't stop either. Med school doesn't stop in general. So I have to keep going. I'm probably gonna get food at some point, take a break. Okay. Pizza roll. Pizza nice, roll. very That's nice. That's not what I was expecting it to look like. Dripping. Yikes. I'll get paper towels. This looks good. Mm -mm -mm. This is like, looks pretty decent. Good morning. Happy Sunday. I'm about to head to school and study for the rest of the day. So I just wanted to close the vlog out here. Um, my exam is tomorrow. I'm not ready to take it yet but hopefully that answer changes by the end of the night and i will see you guys in the next one if you like this video like the video and yeah wish me luck on the exam by the time you watch this of course i'll have taken it but either way wishing me luck would be nice because i'm trying to survive out here in med school so i will see you guys in the next one bye guys oh don't forget to subscribe now, bye guys.